Now we're going to look at three ways to graph a line. The first way, table of values, uh, it is the slowest method, but it always works. Okay, and it actually doesn't just always work for a line, it always works for anything. Whether you have a parabola, a circle, an ellipse, a line, or a blanc, table of values will always work. And it is also the thing that you get churned off a lot from data tables, like results from scientific experiments and so on. So uh, it's useful uh, in that you bump into it a lot. It always works, but it is the slowest. The slope intercept is uh, faster. Uh, in a few minutes, you should be able to graph a line in less than a minute with the slope intercept form, okay? It's uh, not overly hard, uh, and it is very versatile, okay? Uh, you will find that the slope intercept form of a line uh, allows you to enter your line into a graphing calculator. It allows you to work with parallel lines, perpendicular lines, and so many other things that it's, it's very, very versatile and useful. The third method, intercept, intercept, uh, is probably the easiest method. Okay, it gives you a line very quick, and uh, it's uh, it's one that a lot of people, uh, if they're doing a quick quick graph of a line, it may be the easiest to use altogether. So one by one, we're going to look at a table of values then a slope intercept, and then intercept, intercept. You should know how to do all three.